Hello, people of Earth and other galaxies, if you come across this video, welcome back to my channel. Okay, as you see from the title, we are doing another summer bikini haul, okay? And this summer wasn't like real hot girl summer because, you know, COVID and shit, but I still have some bikinis to show you and some cute little things you know so we're just gonna get right into it i don't know if this is gonna be a try on you guys will find you guys will find out later you know because like i don't know if i really want to put these things on right now because i'm lazy but i might do it for y'all i might but let's get into it so first a must have are these tank tops that i'm wearing they're hanes and i got them off amazon this is like a kid's tank top it's like a girl's tank top and i got it in a large and it's so comfy this has been my go-to like i wear it every single day with like outfits to chill in as a cover-up when i go to the beach like it's just it's just a vibe oh my god i can get the necklace it's in the i end up empty okay yeah that's better so yeah the this tank top is one i also have them in white um, I'll link them down below for you guys. They're so cheap. They come in a bundle of three and they're fire. They're soft and it's lit. And I also made like the bottoms that I cut because I'm super short and petite. I made the bottoms like a mini skirt, but like it's too short. So I'll probably just use it as a cover up. Speaking of cover ups, this skirt, let me see. <laughs> I'm so short. Okay, yeah, this skirt. So cute, I got it off Essence, it's Luisa Bellu. And I just love it, I think it's so cute, it's so summery. I feel like this reminds me of like the 2000s era. I love the rings. Um, you can wear this as a cover up or just as a regular skirt. It is really short though, like this is an extra small. And I feel like I should have gotten it small because one, I had to suck it in. OD because like girl I got no abs and I'm bloated okay and like it is short like I cannot twerk what I don't have in this like you know and um, but it's so cute and like if you want to wear it out and like you're worried about panties there's these sticky panties from Amazon that I'll probably link down below as well for you guys um that you can wear with them so there's no line showing but yeah, how cute! I love this so much. They have such cute things like Luisa Balu. I love the brand. They have she has such cute like summery vibes, summery stuff, and cute cover ups and dresses. They're revealing, but it's cute as hell. But yeah, I love this. Like it's so summery and such a vibe. Yeah. Next, we have Shop Gonzo bikinis. So, let me show you guys. Okay, so this is the first one I got. She's cute. She's a thong. Yeah, this is the back. Whoops. And this is, oh, this is the back? No, the tag of the back is here. Well, this is the front. And this is, oh yeah, that's the front and then this is the back because it's supposed to be like super thongy. But yeah, I love this. This isn't a size extra small. Everything is an extra small because I'm really tiny. So this one is super cute. I love, I just love the print so much. Like I've never seen prints like this. And also the material is very interesting. It's like double line mesh. There's no lining, but the mesh is so tiny that you really can't see through it. And the fact that it's double lined makes it you know like you can't see through it and then the top is this one i don't remember the names of the styles but i'll link them down below <laughs> i just i really don't remember <laughs> but this is the top it's so cute you can tie it different ways like you can tie it like you know like here you can tie it just straight it's so cute i love this print so much i want more of her bikinis like i have two and I want more so the next one is this color i am obsessed with this color like 
I look so good in this color. You don't understand, and it's so pretty. I love this color so much, and I love the material. It's the same meshing and then double lines. There's no inner lining, like a separate color, because you know sometimes it's like this and then there's a white or nude lining in the, in the back. Yeah, no. I'm not gonna fuck up my hair, but yeah, this so cute. I love the double string. You can definitely wear it different ways as well, but you know, this is how you wear it. Oh my god, cute! Yeah, I don't know how I did that, but cool. That's how I was trying to figure out how to wear it like that for the longest time, but whatever. And then this super cute like i love the double string and i love this cheeky um bottom like this is one of my favorite styles i think i'm gonna get karibe in this style and like a, the underwire style because it's so cute and like i love the material and like i don't know i just really love the prints and colors of their launch so that's that the local european bikinis like you know are my go-to's um ooh, sorry um they don't have the cream one anymore but they did come out they still have the black and they came out with a rose and a like yellow color and they're so fucking cute and i would highly recommend those bikinis those are my go-to's i still wear them this year and they're just bomb i got this so this set is from pretty little thing I know but I just love the color I saw my friend Alexa who also has a YouTube up here by the way I can link her profile down below but my friend Alexa wore this and I was like uh bitch where'd you get that I love the color and she was like pretty little thing bitch and I was like okay so I went and got it so I don't like the bottoms really much like I like the bottoms but I hate the back of the bottoms because it literally makes me look like I have a diaper so yeah but i love the color of this like i don't know it's just real different it just hits real different like i don't know like this purple just really looks good with my skin tone and i really really love it so yeah highly recommend i don't know if they still have this but it was like six bucks on pretty little thing i know i'm sorry i hate that i shopped there that i shopped for this there but it's fine it's fine it's fine we have a moment of weakness moment of weakness okay other than that those are the only bikinis that i have because i really like have tried to chill because i've had i have so many bikinis that i was like you know what bitch you do not need six more bikinis this summer like where the fuck are you going i've been saying that me and my friends should go to laguna this whole entire summer and we still haven't went and it's almost fall yeah so it's fine but i'm gonna do and like i'm gonna mention more different summer essentials like i have different summer essentials to recommend you other than the bikinis so let's get into it first off this clip super cute right i got it on amazon it was like two for like 10 bucks so five dollars each lit i'm not paying 40 dollars for a fucking hair clip that may or may not clip my hair you feel me so lit also i have this clip from free people how cute but it's so delicate i tried to like really get my hair in there and it broke so i don't really know if i should even recommend it but it's so pretty that i'm like oh, i want to show it anyways i love the color and this was like 16 which is a little cap but whatever whatever now i have sunnies to recommend you so i got these sunnies these Vela. Wela? these wela sunnies and they're so cute wow they're dirty as fuck and i need to wipe them but how cute they fit my head so nice i really like them keep me from the viewings blinding my eyes and i also have another sunny that i had thrifted they're from amani and they're like yellow if i have a picture then i'll insert it here but if not then like i'm sorry you'll probably follow me on instagram to see them but they're super cute like i love them i just i thrifted them so i'm sorry but mm. but this one i did get off depop um which yay but i'm sure you could find them on their website you know or poshmark or depop maybe someone's selling 
sunnies that they're not using anymore, you know? Okay, next summer essential. I found sunscreens that I love. Other than the skin tint, like the Skin Authority skin tint, SPF 50, that one is my daily whatever. But you know, you need to reapply and stuff, especially when you go to the beach. So these are my go-tos. This one, mostly. It's the Black Girl Sunscreen. I got this at Target. You can also get it from her site. I love the kids one. They have different versions. They have like an adult one, which is SPF 30, which I don't really buy because I like SPF 50 and over. Um, SPF 50 and over is like what's effective. So I buy the kids one. It's so nice. And they also have a matte one if you don't like to be like shiny and if you're super oily, but whenever you're at the beach, you're gonna sweat anyways. So I like this one and it's SPF 50 and oh, it's so good. Like I'm almost out of it. And it's been sold out at Target for so long and I hate paying for shipping. So, oh. Like, look at how glowy it makes your skin. It's so nice. I just be applying this when I'm bored to my skin. Like, it just makes my skin look so good. I love, so I highly, I highly recommend the Black Girl Sunscreen sunscreen. Ooh. And then I got, since I was like running out of the Black Girl Sunscreen, I was like, shit, like Target hasn't restocked it. So let me try to find something else. I heard the Bondi Sands one that just came out for the face was good and this is also SPF 50 so I got it and it's a pretty similar like oh, fuck, I just OD'd. similar like texture and stuff like wow like glowy but I feel like the I feel like they're super similar but the black rose sunscreen one is um I believe it's a little cheaper and it's a little bit more hydrating and less greasy. Like it dries down, you're like you're still glowy, but it doesn't leave like a harsh residue. Whereas this one, like I feel like if you have dry skin, you'll like like you definitely feel like a little residue, you know, like lotion residue. I don't know how to describe it, but they're both really pretty. They're both really nice and both smell like sunscreen so yeah and then next up is hair care so I've really been trying to take care of my hair like I don't know like I feel like I really don't do anything to my hair which is like really bad like I don't even put oils in it anymore or like do hair masks which I really need to start because like my ends get really frizzy like so so frizzy and also my hair gets really oily so I'm just like I like thought of this I was just like hmm you know like when oily skinned people like back when I was younger I was super oily and like I would never want to like really moisturize my face and put oils on it because I was scared that I was gonna make it more oily so but it is more it, your skin gets more oily because there's not enough moisture so your skin is trying to like compensate for it like not getting the topical moisture so it releases more oils to keep you moisturized yeah so i was like oh what if my hair is doing that like what if because like my hair is so dry my hair gets so oily on its own because it's trying to hydrate my hair because i'm not hydrating my hair girl i was right because so i got so i got two hair cares that um, conditioners or oils that I've really liked so far um, my hair is very like fine and it's straight and it's I think it's thin but some of my friends say it's like you know, I just don't have a lot of hair so a lot of like harsh oils not harsh just like heavy oils just weigh down my hair like I can't be putting like certain things you know like i don't have curly hair i have straight hair so like the things that work for my curly hair friends just aren't gonna work for me because it's just gonna weigh down my hair and i look crazy you know sometimes that's fine i don't care just put matte oil on my hair and then put it in a bun and call it a day and like really get that hydration in but if i want to like look cute as well no no no, no honey i can't be doing a deep freaking hydrating hydrating mask so I got these two, so I just got this, this Gizio, Gizu, Gizu, I'm pretty sure it's Gizu, Honey Infused Leave-In Conditioner, fire. First of all, I love Gizu like hair products because I just love the smell, like it smells so clean and sweet and just so good and it's not too strong where like you're just, 
like your nose gets sick of it and you get a headache from it so I love this bomb I just spray it outside like in damp hair I even like I even spray it when like my hair gets a little brittle when it's dry I just spray it and then boom like especially at night before I go to bed this one I love it's from Pelor. they just sent it to me and I love this so whenever like probably like once a, once a week I'll do this where I'll put it like two pumps maybe and I'll when my I wash my hair and it's damp like I'll just spread it in my hair it smells so good it smells really herby it's really strong because it'll last throughout the whole entire next day like that's all your my hair would smell like is this oil but it's really hydrating but it doesn't weigh my hair down where like it gets super super oily uncontrollably oily but this has helped me so much i don't put it in my roots i don't put any of these products in my roots i just put it in my ends and then like i feel like it'll still hydrate and it'll it's like the perfect balance of hydration and my hair isn't super frizzy it's not brittle it's like less breakage and I'm just loving it. I've just been really taking care of my, you know, my hair because I feel like taking care of it now before it all falls off when I'm old, you know? You gotta be grateful, gotta take care of her, you know? She needs, she needs some nourishment too. So yeah, that's that. I'm trying to think of what else I can share with you, but that's really it. Oh, I have another purchase that I've really, really been obsessed with this summer, and that is my Rick Owens. I just got these um, in, in the summer and like I've been eyeing them for a while but like I love them. They're so cute. I got the low top ones because I'm really short. I'm five foot and three quarters so I'm five one. But like I got, I wanted the high top ones but then like I tried on my friends and I was like oh this is not cute. Like it makes me look short. So I got the low top ones and I think it looks so much better on me and I love them. They're like my go-tos now. I mean I don't wear them on the beach but I wear them out like all the time. So yeah and honestly that's it that's my haul for the summer i'm sorry it's very short but you know your girl got a budget and like where are we going where are we going i can't even go outside the country so next summer it'll be better but yeah that's it for my haul and i hope you guys like it and i'll see you guys in my next video make sure you follow me on my tiktok my instagram comment down below what else you want to see from me or if you like this video and subscribe and i love you guys so much